welcome back to Tarot by Andy. Thank you for being here. This is my vibrational reading. Please do your own research for entertainment purposes and allegedly. First, I'd like to start out with a little pendulum because it is a yes or no question. I want to find out if uh, Child Protective Services has been called on Harry and Megan. And if so, were the children removed? That is the question for today. So... Has Child Protection Services been called due to the nanny quitting is why I'm asking this. Did the nanny inform Child Protective Services that the children were not in a good place? Did the nanny inform Child Protection Services that the children were not in a good home? Did she inform them? Yes, she did. Okay, that's interesting. Now the next did Child Protective Services end up removing them? Did they remove Lilibet and Archie? Did they remove Lilibet and Archie? I'm getting no. I will re-ask and try again. Did they remove Lilibet and Archie from Megan and Harry's possession? Did Child Protective Services of California remove Lilibet and Archie from their possession? No. Is it under review? Are they under review? Are they under review by Child Protective Services? Are they under current review? Are they under current review? Yes, they are. So they're under current review. Are they likely to pull the children from them? Are they likely to pull the children from them? No. Okay. Will the royals come in and take the children? Come in and take the children and take them to the UK. Will the royals come in and fly them out to the UK? Yes. Has it occurred yet? Has it occurred yet? Just for fun. Has it occurred yet? Has it occurred yet? No. Is it going to happen soon? Is it going to happen soon? Is this going to unfold soon? Yes. Yes. Okay. So let's pull some cards on that. Let's pull some cards on that. We'll do some shuffling here. Hope you guys are doing great. Once again, this is allegedly, it is tarot. So take it for what it is. Hopefully, uh, hopefully this does happen, actually. You know, uh, not a bad thing, really. Here we go. Charles would be getting his way. Here we go. Let's get some cards on the royals pulling and taking those children from Megan and Harry out in California and keeping them in the UK. First card we have here is the Knight of Wands, the Just Do It card. Yeah, that's total uh, coming in. That's like a knight in shining armor, basically, with courage. Uh, so I would say that's looking pretty likely there. Let's get some more. The next card I have here is, oh, yes, we do. The Hierophant, that is Queen Elizabeth right there, you guys. So, yes, they are. They are, absolutely. And we have here the Seven of Pentacles in the upright position. This is something that they're going to be, they had, they're planning and cultivating it. So it's under plans right now, just like what the pendulum said. They're planning it. It's very clear as day. They're coming in. They're just going to do it. Queen Elizabeth, and they're planning and cultivating. Oh, yes, they are. Yes, they are. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, my God. Okay, under the surface, what do I have here? It's because Queen of Swords in reverse. They're not happy with what, what uh, has been going on. And then we have here the Six of Wands in the conscious position, which is in the center of the situation, victory in reverse because they're failing they're failing and they've got a very cold mother there a very cold calculated mother who has an inability to be nurturing not a nurturing female figure there so she is not mothering those kids and the nanny quit and the nanny reported them very interesting <laughs> wow 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 okay so we got our yes, and they're planning and cultivating it. So let's get some more cards. Oh, my. How's it going to go? How is it going to go? Once they're out there, how will everything unfold? How will everything unfold? We have here the King of Swords. 
So I would say that is Charles. Charles finally gets to have his way. Charles got to do it. I think Charles is the one who also called this. So I think this is more Charles's behavior uh, with the Hierophant. I think Charles was the one here. So it was Charles. Let's get some more on Charles here. So Charles is the one who is taking the lead here. He is taking on the king energy. He has to. It's his position. He is next in line. And he is with the intentional leadership position there. So what's coming up next for Prince Charles? We have here because of the eight of pentacles in reverse. There was, they couldn't overcome it. It was an action they couldn't overcome. And the, this is the apprenticeship card. And they're not making money. They're failing. So since they've been failing, and they're failing at being a parent also, you know, being the new parent, uh, the apprenticeship of being a parent, they tend to be failing at it. So they're failing at the task of being parents because it is an energy. And pentacles are our energy and we are energy. And we have here three of cups. So that is, you know, creation expansion. So they have to create the situation to their favor. And then we also have here and be strong in the process, strength. Use that gentle strength to take care of business for justice, cause and effect. It is what it is. The justice is always going to go after what's right. And it's the truth. It's cause and effect. It's the right thing to do. So it's the right thing to do along with the seven of wands. So that is defiance. We're going to fight you and we're going to win. And we, plan, we have to plan and cultivate this. We're going to do it with gentle strength because we have here the five of wands. There's been nothing but horrible fighting and conflicts and fighting dirty. So, but they're going to do it with gentle strength. They're not going to do it that way, but they realize that the home environment is broke. They're not, they're t terrible parents and there's so much fighting within the home and they haven't gained, they're just not, they're just not cut out for it. They're just not cut out for it. They don't have the, they don't have that inner strength and temperance uh, because they, they just can't juggle them, their energies together. Cause I always get that two of pentacles in reverse with them. Uh, let's get under the surface here, back to the Queen of Swords in the reverse positions, back to Markle being a very cold woman, a very cold, rigid, and very unkind woman. So that was what was reported on her by the nanny. Very cold, rigid, and unkind. And they're very aware of that because that's basically the general consensus of her. And it, and, it, and it makes no difference the fact that she's got two kids there. And then we have here the wheel. So this is going to be a completion, a success for them. They're not going to fail at this. They will, they will, they will prevail. Uh, their wheels are not going to fall off on getting these kids. Uh, they're going to charge in and they're going to succeed because she is cold, distant, rigid. She's not capable. And all they do is fight. And they can't, they're, they're losing money more than they're making. And their energies don't jive. And yeah, definitely. And I'd say this it was uh, Charles, is, uh, Charles is the one taking the lead here with that chariot. Yes, he is. So let's get some more energy. How is the Harkles going to handle it? How are the Harkles going to handle it? Well, here we go. That came out. Well, we do have the Page of Wands in reverse. They're obviously not thrilled. <laughs> Dark energy. Uh, with the Page of Wands in reverse, they are not very cheerful about it. They're very upset. Very upset, and it's really bad news for them. Very bad news, so they're very upset, and they are wanting to fight with the Page of Swords upright. So they're going to try and be very secretive. They're watching them, watching their moves. They're spying on them. They're gossiping about them. They're being very insensitive, and it's a card of curiosity. And so they're going to take a calculated risk to fight them uh, while spying on them. Uh, and they're not happy about it. So, but they are, yeah, they are very much keeping an eye on the situation is what those two cards are saying. And they're pages, so take note of that. They're too immature to be parents. And we got here, this one here. We've got the Ten of Pentacles because they want to keep that family legacy. They want to appear as though they've got everything going for them, that they're, you know, they're wealthy. We've got it all. We've got it all and everyone's jealous of us. 
Let's get it some more on this. And we have here Ace of Pentacles in the upright. So they want to keep those kids. They want to keep the kids because they need those kids for any, any new beginning. Uh, it's, it's physical. They want to look like they're grounded in front of everyone. And it gives them opportunity. So they don't want to lose any opportunities by losing the kids. They're just really a token. They're, they're an asset. They're an appliance to the narcissist. So they don't want to lose their appliance. Under the surface, what do we have here? They are ready, willing to go to battle for it, Knight of Swords. Yeah, they're willing to go to battle over it, Knight of Swords, and they're, they're, they don't think they're going to lose. And then in the center of the situation, they're going in where they're trying to use wisdom to fight them. They think they're going to use wisdom uh, to fight them and that they have the wisdom, which we know they don't. So let's find out how will it go down. Well, they're going to win. I already know. They're going to they're gonna win. They're going to lose, but they think they can win. So that is how they're reacting. They don't want to lose that meal ticket, as we all know, and their pages. They're pages, and they're going to be the knight trying to fight them. So how does the rest of the family feel about this? How does the rest of the family feel about this? Here we go. We feel They feel that it is the hangman in reverse. It's not a self-sacrifice. Uh, you know, so they don't have to even sit and think about it. They're not even going to pause. They're just going to jump in and do it. Uh, it is in the selfish po position, but they're not willing to pause on it too long because they are children. That's how I view this. So it is in the reverse position. So that, and they are selfish parents. So that would be the other reason. They're selfish parenting style. And the emperor in reverse. So that's inflexible dominator. There's no question. I'm the boss. I'm coming in. I'm doing it. And they realize that. The rest of the family realizes it, that the, they're, they're selfish parenting. They don't need to think about it long. We're going to be the inflexible dominator, and we're just going to come in and do it because you don't have a say about this. Uh, we will do what we want to do. So they're just going to do it. They don't care what you think. And we have here the queen of pentacles in reverse. So they want to make sure she doesn't get to keep them. Uh, they, she does not want them, they do not, the family does not want Markle to have possession of the children. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. And we also have here also the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. They don't want her to have that fulfillment of using them as, as tokens. So yeah, they really want to take away all those financial opportunities and using them as, um, you know, as, as a money-making tools for her future. Uh, I pulled out my spirit animal because it's a fun deck and I haven't used it in a while. So let's get spirit animal on the situation. What's going to happen? Let's get some overall energy on this, on the children going back to the UK and, and child protective services being called on them and being rescued. We have the elephant. We have the elephant energy. The elephant energy. Elephant is very caring. I mean, wow, they take care of their young, you guys. 147. I'm going to pull out my book here and read it. It's upright, so that is the beautiful position. Unstoppable. They are unstoppable and wise. When it's in balance, it's one pointed focus and it's generous and loving. So the elephant. Uh, the elephant represents immense wisdom as well as good fortune. It is said that the elephant is the destroyer of obstacles. Okay, so they're going to destroy that obstacle. Enough said. Enough said. It's gentle, noble. It illuminates the way with the light of self-knowledge. So they're going to come in with that inner knowing uh, of everything they know, and they're going to take care of business. The elephant, what do they do? They take care of their young. So they're going to do it, you guys. They're going to do it. They're going to do it. They have no choice. These two are so unhinged and unwell. They really have to do the right thing for the children. Um, they can't do that. I mean, it's just not right for the kids. They're at such a young, vulnerable age. This is so, such a pivotal time in their life as to how they're going to turn out later on. Okay, this is reverse. We got here. And, but I would say Charles is not concerned at this point because he knows what he's going to do. What happens when you make a decision, your concern goes out the door, your anxiety goes out the door. He knows what he's going to do. He's not concerned about the outcome. And we have here tool and labor because he's working on it. He's working on it. He's got a plan of action 
and we have here wow bringing them home bringing them home and we have here the occupation in reverse he's not actually working on it other people are doing it for him so he's just calling the shots other people are working on it, are actually going to go in and do the rescue i would say he's just making the orders and plan and doing the behind the planning uh planning behind it so let's get some lenormand uh, pull my lenormand here we go some lenormand on the situation on the rescue of the children the rescue of the harkles children here we go it's because everything's unhappy there they want them to be happy we got the sun card and it's a seated situation so seating highlighted the situation it's it's people are aware it's an awareness the, the the whole situation has been lit up basically with the sun and that's kind of what the sun card represents too and let's get some more cards here sorry i bumped you here we go some more on the situation rescuing those children yay i know so many of you guys have been so worried about these kids i mean it really it is they're such innocent victims in all of this situation just innocent little souls here we go we have here authority oh loving it loving it loving it oh my god i'm loving it yes 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 between the elephant and the authority and prince charles oh yeah oh yeah i'm loving it just like well i won't even say the fast food chain <laughs> Don't know why I was thinking that at the time. I don't even like that place. Here we go. We're going to get some wisdom. Some wisdom. Some wisdom on the situation with the royals taking over those children and rescuing them out of California and away from toxic parenting, violent home, unloving mother, cold, calculated, rigid woman. Oh, the summon. They are summoning those children with authority. I am loving this. Oh, yes, indeed. Oh, my God. Wow. Okay. Let's get some more. Yes, yes, yes. Let's get some ener more energy. Here we go. On this situation, getting these children, getting these children out of the UK. Here we go. We have here friendship, friendship. The I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. So they understand that they're in their life for a reason. In gratitude, I am thankful for this life and the opportunities that it presents. So they they want to they want to get to know these children, uh, and they want the children to have gratitude for them. They want to develop a relationship with them and get them out of that kind of um, area, get them out of that kind of um, situation. They, they view them as family, uh, basically. Let's get this here. Boom, here we go. Oh, wow. Wow. The child I was meant to be. So they feel they belong with them. Despite whatever the situation is, they want them with them. Maybe they'll never be working royals because I know Charles is downsizing everything, but they still want them on UK soil. Uh, they are interested in them. They do want to um, protect them. Um, and they do probably want to do DNA. Uh, they want to get to know them and they want them to, they want to have authority over them and they're going to summon them so that's how i see this wow 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 okay let's see um i was going to do the dark energy did i do dark no i did i did the summoning okay so let's see anything else i could pull here i'm going to pull my energy deck here we go my energy deck this energy deck here we go and then we can go Hope you guys have a great Friday evening. Here we go. This card here. And because he is not a thinking man. Harry doesn't think very well for himself. He's not being a, a good father figure. And it's in reverse position. Yeah. Between her being cold and Harry not thinking straight, they're going to take the kids. I hope you guys enjoy this. Till next time, like and subscribe. Bye, you guys.